Hi, this is K5EMB. I wanted to talk a little bit about setting up a node on All-Star with a Raspberry Pi 2. I've created an 8 gigabyte image file based on Raspbian for this machine that uh, contains asterisk and OMON 2 and is almost ready to go. Of course, you're going to have to do the final configuration steps yourself for your individual individual node. Um, since I don't have different types of interface hardware to test on, I could really use uh, your feedback as to how well this works with your particular setup. All right, things you will need. I assume that you either have a node number or are familiar with requesting one from All Star Link. Uh, if you're not, this can take 24 hours or so. Uh, you're going to need your node number and your node password code for the iax.conf file. Um, if you're transferring an existing node to the Pi, uh, you're going to need some way to copy the existing configuration files from Etsy asterisk. Um, you're also going to need access to your router firewall to uh, do IP assignments and port forwarding if that's necessary. Um, of course you're going to need the 8 gig or larger micro SD card for the Pi 2. Um, PuTTY or some other terminal program to SSH into the Pi. Um, WinSCP is good to have to copy files back and forth. Um, and finally, I use Win32 Disk Imager from SourceForge.net, but any image writer will do. This transfers the, the downloaded file to your SD card. All right, let's start with the download from the UKAllStarHub.com website. Um, it's a zip, and it's about 1.3 gigabytes. I expanded it 7 point something. Go to blog. And your instructions in the download. It may take a little while, but it shouldn't take too long. We'll get back to this later. All right. Let's assume that the download completed successfully and you were able to unzip it. Um, open your file here um, and select your device. In this case, my um, 8 gigabyte card is on the G drive. Make sure that's correct because uh, you don't want to overwrite the wrong uh, external device. Um, write. It'll prompt you for this. And we'll just let that run for a few minutes. Now that this is done, we can uh, remove the power from the Pi, uh, replace the micro SD, and uh, power it on. Now, use PuTTY to go to your DHCP assigned IP address and port 22. Log in as Pi. And the password is Raspberry. And then what I would do is sudo su or add the dash, set the root password, and in this case I'll just make it something simple. Then I would update the pi password.
All right. Using WinSCP, your IP address, uh, port 22, and your new root password. Want to log in to the Pi? It will appear here. Navigate to Etsy asterisk. Go to your local documents where you have your config files copied from your previous installation and highlight them all, drag and drop. This is one file that you're going to need um, that you may not have already. chan.dotty.conf. It contains only channels in brackets. That's all you need. Um, extensions.conf, iax.conf, rpt.conf, and usbradio.conf in this configuration will need to have your node number and in the case of iax.conf your node password uh, modified. You can edit them uh, fairly easily just by right click edit and the notepad editor. Node number 41808 in this case and next step. Back on the putty terminal you need to reload asterisk to get the new config files in place. And for this configuration um, I've attached a generic sound fob uh, with a speaker. So we can just simply uh, test without a radio. Um, connect to asterisk. And then um, let's just uh, play a sound file. And there we go. And some telemetry. Uh, let me wait a minute or so and make sure that this is registered on the system. After a few minutes have passed, we can try connecting to the UK hub. Node 2706. Six connected to node four one eight zero eight. And that's it. A couple more things to note for this image. Um, if you want to set a static IP address, go to Etsy Network, the file interfaces. Replace this line with these lines. This is also on the um, UK All Star Hub under blog. To set up Almon 2, there is a web server which is already configured. And if you go to var www almon, uh, this is the Almon 2 code which is unconfigured. Uh, go through this README file and you should get a good idea of how to set it up. Thanks for watching and uh, visit UKAllStarHub.com for all the uh, latest information. 73